Hey again, welcome back to day two of me filming another video. <laughs> welcome back to another video of me speaking about my own personal opinions and my journal and just a place for me to doodle and scribble in words in or in my own voice and if you're wandering around youtube you're just venturing you want to hear a little a little opinion from somebody unknown uh, uh, who is non-relevant to you but who has who has maybe contained some very inspiring quotes along with him i really appreciate that if you're staying to watch so if you're still watching you can tag along and hopefully what i'm about to say next will help you prosperize pros prosperize pros prosperity what prospect prosper anyways <laughs> Today, I'm going to be talking about self-improvement and my guide to for you is that to anyone on stage one who needs a little push or needs a little setback to actually step back and look a little at his front look a little further and also look at himself from a third person view so if you're currently watching Andrew Tate videos it would be and my guess would be that you're on stage one and you're watching a lot of Andrew Tate videos okay and you just procrastinate, you talk about money, but you you say you like to own a this car, that car, a wonderful house, a girl with gigantic boobies. Yeah, man. But you continue to say that, okay, I'm going to be rich one day, I'm going to... Um, Take care of my family, yeah, provide for the kids, you know, four wives and shit like that. Okay, I get you. I get you. But the main thing is, you're not actually going to, you're not actually going to get anywhere, bro. From an honest, from an honest point for me, you're not going to get anywhere self-improvement just by watching tiktok videos alone is actually just a form of mental masturbation i'm sorry bro i had to go down this rabbit hole and i had to tell you something that might as well have hurt your pride your ego you see the reason i've decided to create this video is to talk to myself to actually teach to actually be my own self critic to be my own teacher and also to be a, the best student I can which is about stage 2 but you're on stage 1 which is you're self aware but you're not taking action there's one thing you need to do if you're stuck in stage one. You need to form a little bit of discipline. How are you going to do that? You need to let go of your ego. Now my friend, what is ego? Okay, think of it as this. You're a person, the core of you, as a person, you have a core and a shell. 
the core of you is stagnant and only grows at a very tight point when you are stressed and you actually try and try and use your real hard work with action that you can expand it but you see your the core is here and there is an outer shell this shell i would like to call is our identity our identity is actually vast it can it can expand it can contract because our identity is only set by our minds now there are benefits of actually focusing on identity rather than than um your actual self which is ego your ego can be the best weapon you ever had but also a weapon of mass destruction to your own personal arsenal with ego you can grow your identity as much as possible and you will have some room for yourself to grow but you see if you only use all your potential on your outer shell you're stuck with a simple core but a humongous fucking shell that is ego my friend and you remain the same person who you ever was but just with a huge Ex exaggerated confidence so you need to get out of ego my friend because ego is delusion confidence is earned ego is self-anointed number two upgrade yourself slowly but surely Pick a purpose for yourself. What would you actually want to do with your life? Where do you want to go in 10 years? And don't say own a Lamborghini. Don't say you're going to do dropshipping. Don't say you're, you're going to start an online business that was pro prescribed to you by Andrew Tate himself or some, some, other, some other random ce celebrity influencer or some YouTubers. Those fake kinds of red pew youtubers you need to focus on yourself you need to develop yours yourself and that matters on your genetics i can't say much because i don't know who you are i only who know who i am and i'm currently focusing on youtube because i believe that i i if i teach people while well, i can make a living out of it I'm really going to I'm really going to be happy because I'm more of a type of creative but also caring and agreeable type of person I've left um, a little personality test at the bottom of the video so I have a really open mindset but I'm also very 62% conscientious I'm not really positive or affirmative about that one but maybe um, I'm more conscientious now because I have I've been on self-improvement for like one year now or so mm, yeah and don't worry about your personality too much because all you need to do is just be experimenting here and there here and there here and there you need to find out who you um, are and what career suits you best because no one no one on earth cares about chiropractors am I right and no one or on earth really wants to help dentists with marketing their businesses and shit like that if you're thinking about SMMA but you you need to go through try and error and truly find out 
where you enjoy yourself the most where you, and I truly think like where are the numbers where are the numbers that come to you the best when compared to other people which means which game do you play the best at and get the most result out of uh, compared to majority of the people because you don't want to be playing a losing game so upgrade your discipline to fit your purposeful life but the first thing I recommend to everybody who is on self-improvement go to the gym there is no there is no coping to this you have to go to the gym go to the gym most of my discipline came from the gym I've trained vast I've trained largely I've even managed to get from someone who hates studying who absolutely hates the school system to actually okay I hate it but it's my duty as a man and speaking of which men number three masculinity if you're a man you're I'm gonna take this from Andrew Tate's words himself if you're a man you're born with little to no value at all you need to work on your value by yourself if you're a woman then for sure all, all the power to you man but if you're a man man oh man You gotta work hard if you want status, if you want people to get to like you. Or if you're born with good looks, or if you're born with a big heart like me, <laughs> or if you're born with charisma, which I also don't have, and that is my mission as well. I'm planning to become a person who can talk well and reciprocate words very effectively and better so on the point of being a man there is no coping you there is no video games there is no there is no anything that you can enjoy for now because you need to build yourself Genetics are only what have been given to you. You must, but talent without hard work is mostly useless. It is non negotiable, non negotiable, and I wouldn't I wouldn't pick you if I had. A hundred men who I had to pick. I'm enjoying myself. I'm talking. Out out of question, but I'm enjoying myself. First time ever. You're gonna need to work hard. Yeah, I've made a video earlier about. Um, me getting friend zoned. I realized that I really wanted to quit. I really wanted to say screw you life. I can't handle this. I I just want to be a kid forever. I just want to be liked automatically. But you know what? I've been given a purpose and that is Whether I want to or I don't want to. I choose to or I choose not to. That is the ultimate purpose. So you just have to deal with the consequences. You have to deal with the pain at the current moment and actually get to to 
the success that you are aspiring for that you hope for that you are have ambitious have ambitions for but you can't cope because coping like instant gratification video games all of this you're not going to get anywhere I hope you enjoyed this video it's truly from a big heart Eve I love you guys or I love you Johnson <laughs> maybe your name is Johnson but um, I would also like to mention one person if you're watching this Leo Axel you're my bro man you've inspired me to create these two videos from just from your video that I saw just now great video and yeah well it's been a long time all right have a good one